Hello everyone, welcome back to Trev Dog Gaming here on YouTube. This is the game Subsistence, and we are in Season 2, and now Episode 171. Well, today's the day that we look at trying to finish off the Glass Tower. So we've got walls to put on and a roof. I guess it's going to almost look like an airplane control tower. An observatory tower is probably more what it was meant to be, but anyway. It'll be kind of all made of glass, uh, except for that back wall where the elevator track runs, but yeah, give us a good view from up the top there to have a look around. Could be stuff added to the game later that we don't know about that could be useful, I suppose, but uh, yeah, just off camera I just killed a wolf, so I'm going to go put that to use. I've got the... Yeah, hang on. Let's have a look. How many livers do I have in here? No, nope, I have to cook it. I could just put that one in there and cook that one up and eat it. Hmm, that sounds like a plan, Trev. Alright, we'll yank those out. So, I was busy um, making a few more glass panels. I still don't think I have enough. Um running very low in the glass fragments. I've got 39 there and I've got 38 in here. I made a couple of ingots and another 8 glass panels so I've got a total of 79. I have a feeling I might be about 8, 9, 10 glass panels short so we're gonna have to make another kinda do another run on those I think. Um, I can grab a water. Gee, I'm getting low in the water, aren't I? Uh, what should I grab? The potato. How far will the potato go? Nah, yeah, it's not too bad. I don't even know if I can fit the liver in. When it decides to come out. Gee, that's a lot of biofuel stuck in there. I have got a lot of biofuel, so it doesn't matter if I use the mass fabricator for a bit, I guess. Wait for this to pop out. I'm still waiting, obviously, for the mass to go up so I can make some more glass. Can I eat that? Oh, there you go. So where are we up to? Oh, well, we're getting up pretty quick. We're getting up pretty quick. We can possibly... Hang on, how many... 36 will make 9 glass panels, right? I reckon that's got to be so close. Are we at 90 yet? We are just now. Wow. Alright. There's 8. Do we remain above 10? We do. Okay. Alright, well. Yeah, we've gone right to the edge on our glass fragments. The scrap 2, I've gone down to 20 in the cupboard, so that's it. So I think I might need about 36, I think. Uh, okay, so if I look in this cupboard, I should be able to do what the latest update did. Now I need four of the normal walls, I believe, and four of the curved walls. So let's start with these guys. Pretty certain that's what we did. Yeah, this is one of those things that... If you kind of make a bit of a mistake when you're on the timber stuff, you kind of don't really care as much. But the glass stuff, because it's so hard to get a hold of. There's a few more. Yeah, I was just thinking I haven't visited here for a while. Yeah, we have gone through a lot of ore. But then we have quite a lot of, um... We do have quite a lot of fragments in there. I mean, 400 plus iron, 400 plus copper, 400 plus zinc. The only one that we've really crunched away at is definitely this um, sandstone to produce the glass fragments in turn to make the... Um, oh, there's another eight. Uh, to make the glass panels so that we can... Wow. Alright. Well, we'll steadily do a little bit at a time, I guess. I think, though, uh, these panels that are being made should be about it, so hang on a sec. Do we need to let that run? Eh, could. How about we let it run while we go up and do the walls, the square walls, put it that way. Make sure you're on the actual elevator. Then we 
and do the full run to the top. Cool. Alright. Yeah, I think that's the case. There's just four square walls. So if I swap out... So, one there... I can always change little bits and pieces later, I, I guess. But I was thinking, don't forget, those two kind of ceilings, wooden ceilings that are just down there on the edge aren't meant to really be there. I was wondering whether I could make something out here and then jump down into the water, but I'm not sure how <laughs> how safe that is, but... It would be cool to have a doorway that goes out there to a little glass... Yeah, I'm not sure what the integrity of that would be like. Either. Hmm... Okay. Oh, I tell you one thing I didn't calculate. It's not a big deal, but I think I'm one... One glass ceiling less than I thought, because there's got to be one in the middle here, isn't there? Hmm... Okay. Let's go down, we'll go grab the, um... Corner pieces, I guess. All the plants and stuff seem to be doing quite well, which is good. So, uh, let's make, then, four of these. How's the mass doing now? I suppose it's... 63? Eh, not too bad. I uh, might let them run a little bit longer. I love the fact that this biofuel can be used like that. And plus, how much do we have left in here? 30 something, jeez. Not bad. Top that up, top that up. I'm just gonna have a sneaky look at the chickens. Oh, hang on a second. Who came in there and didn't close the door? Not that I was expecting rogues or anything, but still. Wouldn't it be funny if they could come in and just open the doors on you unless you locked them or something? <laughs> Uh, they probably do need a bit of watering. What are you guys? Level 2 and level 10. Alright. Let's just take care of these little guys. Can't have them going hungry or thirsty. So 70%. So here, on that one's 70. Is that one... Yeah, okay, they're exactly the same. Might as well take the fertilizer. Leave the food a little bit longer. Alright, now, yeah, so put the fertilizer away. Got a fair bit in there, actually. And where's my mast now? Yeah, that's pretty comfortable, I think. So let's just turn these off. It's got a real hum to it, hey? Ah, peace and quiet. Alright, so we've got the four curved bits, so we'll try that. I like it when you get to this one and then you can kind of just, you know, look around a bit at this level and then you click this and go all the way up to the top and look right around. Yeah, certainly a good view. Oh, that's right, I started putting... Near the wind turbines, I started putting another s two solar panels. Otherwise, there's like five lots of six and another one. Yeah. Base looks quite cool from up here. Different perspective, I guess. Alright, well... Here we go for the corner pieces. Feels a bit safer when you can't fall off, kind of thing. There you go. Yeah, at least you can kind of see through everything, but. So, yeah, I was just thinking, oh, another four ceilings, but no, it's actually five. So, five standard square ceilings, followed by four corners, or corner ceilings, and we should be right. believe 
how long the elevator stood there for unfinished anyway okay let's see do we have the parts that's the question so we need actually five of these I think we're gonna be one ingot short aren't we all right hang on let's grab a little bit of this gear and make another ingot oh there's the other panels uh, one ingot thank you throw that in there I guess. So where were we? There, so we can make four. The adhesive's not really a problem. So you can go on and make four. And then when this is finished we can set up number five. I don't believe that it needs anything else. I mean you could get even more fancy and upgrade it as well later, do something a bit different perhaps, I don't know. Okay, so there's the five normal ceilings. So the corner ones, the glass ceiling curved, oh that's the only thing I need is a bunch of uh, these guys, the iron fragments. Oops, the box truth. So yeah, we just need the four glass ceilings that are curved. Oh wow, okay, so yeah, I'm going to be short still. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, everything else is cool. To make the four of these, I need another six glass panels. Is that right? I can make two... <laughs> Oh dear. Yeah, that should be enough. Oh well, it's been a long process, I guess, but... Yeah. Okay, so I've got five glass panels, then I just need to make four of these. But before I can make four of these, I need to make... How many more? Another six glass panels, right? So... I need to yank those out of there. Glass panel. Hopefully I got that right. Okay. And I can put all my fragments back so the copper can go back there. Yeah, I'm not doing too badly in these other fragments, I guess. Hmm. But yeah, you'd... Well, unless you were, um, you know, go and grab some tucker. Make sure they're always updated, which is cool. So let's see, what do we want to eat? Um, definitely need at least a water. Carrot, potato, and a steak. Oh, well, that was pretty quick. Pretty full. So let's have a look, where are we up to? Another three more, because that gives us nine. We need three more, I think that's correct. Oh, I still need the iron fragments, don't I? In actual fact, I need how many? 20. There you go. 20 of those on me. And then I should be able to make the four of them as soon as the last few of these get made. Which is only one more. Cool. Take that out, put that in there. Oops. So I've got the five square ones in my hotbar. I just need to make four of these curved. Why why have I got and what the crap is that? <laughs> what what what? How come I just got infected? Did you guys see that? How come what? I just got infected somehow. Wow, I've never seen that before. I was just standing at the bench making stuff. Oh, I wonder if it thinks I just drank water. You know how sometimes you hear water gurgling underneath? I wonder if it thought I was connected to the lake and I just had a drink of water. Wow. Okay, well. 
just as well I've got antidotes spare. Um, yeah, I've never seen that before. Alright, well these are being made on me, so I might as well just head off up to the top. Try finishing this off. What a view. But it would be better if I could... What did I just use a health kit for? Because I'm so used to using that, aren't I? Hang on. We have to get this right. Can we... The one I'm just trying to put in, if I just drag this back towards me a bit... There you go. And then, put one on this side of that one. Like that. And then we'll do the same thing again. There you go, I've got that working. We want. Oh, I can't fall off now because I'm <laughs> up against the edge. Just make sure I kind of stand kind of in the middle. One more. Two more. There you go. There's that one. And I guess the same thing again. Can I walk backwards here? So they're the four square ones. And now we just need to drag these down and do the corner bits. And these might need a rotation too, actually. And that one works like that. Or maybe you just got to spin around a bit. You know what I mean. There you go. I wonder if it deadens the sound a bit when you do that as well. Yay! There you go, it's completed. I mean, it's a kind of a... It's a look thing, and I suppose it's a comfort thing as well. You can kind of look around and see everything. You know, from up here I can kind of look down and see if, you know, Charlie the Hunter's come down to this part of the lake and whatnot. Actually, it would be pretty cool at night, too, because um, you can look out, and on the map, if you see a rogue that's in the forest over there, you can see exactly where... Oh, I know why. Did I not wash my hands? That's what that must have been. <laughs> Just pulled my gun out, looking at my hands going, they're all red. I, what? When did I do that? Oh, right at the back, right before I started taping. Yeah, I killed a um, a dog just out here. I didn't wash my hands, I'm pretty certain I didn't. Oh, that's my fault. My bad. Sorry, people. <laughs> I just remembered. Oh, that'd do it, Trev. Forgetting to wash your hands. I took the antidote, but my hands were still dirty. Gee, just as well it doesn't reinfect you. Anyhow, let's see what it all looks like from the outside. Have a look, see. Yeah, I thought it'd look a bit like a airplane control tower. <laughs> oh well. Yep. See, she's a uh, she's a real beaut, my little ATV. She sits exactly where she should. Oop. There's oh, there's another dog back there. Hey, there's another crate over there too, by the way, Trev. Yeah, l looks a bit chunky. I must say, but still, it's meant to be an observatory kind of tower, so... Yeah. You can certainly see it from a distance, I guess, can't you? You know, you could make it as tall as you wanted to, sort of thing, but that's a lot of resources just to get it up that high. So, it's sort of like three... Three elevator... Platforms, I guess to the start of the tower on the roof, and then another four, and then the one at the top. So I guess you kind of level eight above the water, maybe? Eight and a half, whatever that is. Wow. 
this it certainly takes a bit of a bit of work We'll have a look from over here. I just want to go grab this crate. Don't think any of the animals would mind, as long as it's not a grizzly just here. Can't see one. Oh! Don't mind a little bit of extra different drink, I suppose. Don't think there's anything else around here worth picking up. The sun's about to go down, might get a bit of a bit of a look at this at night too. Where's uh Where's the doggy gone? Over here somewhere? There he is. Grab a couple of trees and a bit of fiber I guess before we go in. Oh there's the grizzly bear. Will he mind if I cut down this tree? I can see his name tag. Oh, you're kidding me. It's a locked crate. Okay, i only got one, uh... <laughs> one lockpick left. Should I? It's level 3. I won't get myself into trouble, will I? Grizzly can stay over there. Does that get mean he gives you more gear? Come on. Oh yeah. Now it's Trev. Wash your hands. Yeah, I was just wondering if it did end up being still alive, I was going to trade it for the other, the other chicken. Yeah, from a distance it looks quite, um, noticeable, doesn't it? The high tower and the size of it and all that. Oh. Not sure what I was looking at then, I was looking down, oh that's weird. I could have done with scrap though, game. That would have been good. Yeah, I'm going to have to do a bit of grinding to grab some more scrap. I wonder what the next adventure is going to be though. Like, what else am I going to build? I know there's accessories and stuff that could possibly be coming available for the ATV, so that could be cool. Something new. Or another vehicle, perhaps? Boat? I don't know. Make a fishing boat that actually gives you more chance of catching bigger fish deeper in the lake or something. You know, I don't know, something a bit different. How are you off food now? 61? Hmm. Well, kind of getting there, I suppose. Alright, well, we're getting closer to night time. We'll have a look and see what, uh, see what the observatory tower looks like at night, I suppose. And that would be a good thing to do. Buy a fat can go in there. Uh, we can cook up that, definitely. We can probably cook up the chook chook. That away. A little bit of ammo. Yeah, I'm not. Oh, I grabbed a few shotgun shells, which was actually pretty good. Um, gee, you reckon I got enough grubs? It's almost 600 grubs in there. I probably need to do a little bit more um, fishing off camera, I think. Put a little bit more in there. Now hang on a second, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I must have went over by three. I must have. Oh well, got a few extra panels, I guess. Not a lot, but I've got something. Okay, that's still a cooking. I'll drink that. It'll do a bit of my carbs and my water at the same time. I'll eat the chicken, and then I'll have a spare steak. I'll spare that, I'll spare this. And then we have to
to go and feed the chook chooks. I'm going to do, let's have a look, need some lights on because it's got very dark very quickly. So before we go up to the observatory tower, I guess what we're going to cook, or we might as well cook it while there, we're going to do the famous Courtney steak and eggs, that's what I'm doing, to feed the chickens. So we're doing two steak and eggs, how's that? Hang on a second. What? Steak and eggs was one... Did I grab out three steak? No... What? Hang on, that's a bit confusing. It says it's making two of them. I know I grabbed out four eggs. Oh, I'm a bit confused. Oh, looks like it's cooking it. Alright, well let's go up, it's dark. Anything I can look at? Oh wow, there's a road right at the very top of the map up there. Little fire going, looks like Charlie's out doing something. Alpha is there, but I can't see him doing much. Bravo, you can see his little fire out, but that's about it. No other rogue, oh there's a rogue up here. Oh, hang on. Is there two of them, or is he just move? Oh, there's gunfire going on. Just, <laughs> just see that. I wonder what he's firing at. Must be a bear or something up there. Still going. Still going. Holy dooly. That's a lot of gunfire. What's he shooting at? I see where he is. He's right on the edge of the water up, way up there. Okay. Oh well. Oh, I thought something was cooking. No, that's just the bacon and eggs, so I'll come back. Hey, I wonder if we can see any of that from up here. I wonder if you can actually see the flashes. I mean, it does have to be a rainy night. can't see their little fires burning or anything like that, but kind of would have been way up there in that direction somewhere. Almost in line with all Outpost 1. I don't think I can see the fire going from this guy, because he would be way up there somewhere. I think it's easier when they're just on the... well, it's easier when there's no rain around either, but and it's a clear night. Huh. Yeah, it looks funny, but you can see everything, can't you? Because you can look down and see all the veggie patches and solar panels, wind turbines, the front of the base down there, garage. It is a bit hard to see because it's so dark and it happens to be a, a rainy, cloudy night, which is a shame. Sure, if I can, s I don't know. Anyhow, oh well. I'll have to show that again when it's not so cloudy. I think. Okay. Don't need the gun anymore, Trev. How's the old steak and eggs going? There they are. So, grab one each. Go and feed the chook chooks. They would have to be down close to 55 now, wouldn't they? Oh, 56, so that's, that's good enough. There they go. So that'll be up to 100 each already. Oh, nice of them to give me that to eat. Oh, it gave me an egg. Actually, I might as well grab that out. Yeah, I know, it was yummy, 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 wasn't it, eh? Chickens, steak and eggs, you can thank Courtney for that, because, uh... That's her particular special steak and eggs for the chooks. Very good, very good. Alright, well... What else do I need? Maybe a carrot to eat. There you go. All good. 
Alright, well that's it. I guess um, that feels pretty good knowing that that tower is up there now. It's completed finally. It's taken a lot of resources to get to there, but I think I'm just going to have to do a bit of grinding and maybe do a bit more battling because we still have to test out our floodlights at night when we get a revenge attack, so... I don't know. I guess, you know, is, is it the most fun just going after Charlie? Because he's got the most resources. It might be time to do another Charlie attack, I think. So I might do a bit of off camera grinding a little bit and then uh, we'll line up another attack of Charlie and see what the revenge attack is like um, with the floodlights but it depends on when he attacks of course if he attacks during the day I'm not going to be able to use them so although just before I go hang on a second hang on let's just try this plenty of power gun so I should have the floodlights on at the moment it's still fairly dark See, that's another look at night. Yeah, most of that front part of the base is definitely lit up. At least I can see them if they were fighting me, but this corner, this is the one I need to do another light on. Just here. Just go down that way. And then that whole part of the tree there, and right along the front, is uh, completely lit up, I think. Yep, I reckon that would be awesome. So I might have to think about doing that after I do a little bit more grinding, I guess. Very good. Glad I got that little set of stairs there now. Makes it a little bit easier to get to the front. Turn those off. So what's our power like at the moment? Four and a half thousand masses back. That's pretty good. Oh wow, has it gone to morning already? Gee, that didn't take long. Wow. Alright everyone, I will leave the episode here. Hope you've enjoyed today's episode. Hope you enjoy seeing that finally being completed as well. If you've liked the video, you can certainly help the channel out by smashing the like button for the video. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, you can mega help the channel out by subscribing. Alright everyone, thanks so much. Cheers.